the stepped shaft shown rotates at 450 revolutions per minute. If the radius of the fillet is 0.5 inches, what is the maximum power that can be transmitted without exceeding an allowable shearing stress of 7500 psi? This is the second example for the torsion and bending stress concentrations main video. The links to that video and other examples are in the description below. Recalling the expression for power from physics, where t is the torque and omega the angular velocity, we see that we can use the RPM information to find omega. 1 revolution is equal to 2 pi radians and 60 seconds is equal to 1 minute. With the angular velocity information, we see that we can find the maximum power if we have the maximum torque. To find that maximum torque, we'll use that the maximum shearing stress, which happens for a maximum torque at the stress concentration, should not exceed the given maximum allowable shearing stress. This means that the maximum torque depends on the radius of the smaller section C, the polar second moment of area for that smaller section, and the stress concentration factor K. To find that stress concentration factor, we need the R over D ratio for the x-axis and the capital D over lowercase d ratio to identify the plot we're using. The plot will be that roughly two-thirds of the way from 1.11 to 1.25. This corresponds to a K value of about 1.33. Substituting the values, we see that the torque should be no greater than 138 kip inches. With this maximum torque value and the angular velocity we previously found, we find the value for the maximum power in pound inches per second, and knowing that one horsepower is equal to 6,600 pound inches per second, we find a maximum power of 988 horsepower. For more examples on bending and torsion stress concentration factors, as well as the videos for the other topics of the Mechanics of Materials course, make sure to check out the links in the description below. Thanks for watching.